Hello, my beautiful crafty friends. How is everyone doing? Me, I'm so excited. You guys, I just got out of the Dollar Tree and I found some mind blowing stuff. I cannot wait to show you the products that I found. Um, in fact, I thought, why not just do it in the car? The last time I did it in the car, it turned out fine. So I figured, why not? I'm gonna put my steering wheel down as much as I can so you guys can get a good look. They had Christmas stuff out. So at the end of this video, I will put a little clip of what I went ahead and filmed of the little Christmas stuff they had. I got some of the dollar stuff and some of the dollar uh, plus section, which were some really pretty lanterns, um, some really cute gnomes. It looks like gnomes is going to be big this year. They kind of started a couple years ago, but it looks like they're kind of taking over. So anyways, let's dive in and let me show you the most marvelous affordable things that I found. But we're going to start with Crafty Christmas, okay? I picked up one thing of Halloween because I'm pretty much done with my Halloween stuff. But I picked this guy up because I liked the shape of the sign and it could be painted over and I can use them for other um, DIYs. So I picked up one sign and then you guys, oh my goodness gracious me oh my, I can't remember seeing these last year. You get four large snowflakes um, unfinished that are attached to twine, but I like the size of them because I also picked up these snowflakes and as you can tell, these ones are bigger. So it's two different sizes on a project. I figured that would be nice. And then I picked up several packages of the snowmen because they make such great feet. Last year, I couldn't find them. This year I found them. They look a little smaller than what I remember on all the other DIYers channels, but I figured why not go ahead and stock up since I found them, because once you see something at Dollar Tree, you have to pick it up right then and there. If you go back, it's gone. They also had the cutest little trees. Look at those, aren't they adorable? I can't remember if those are new, but I know these are new. They had little itty bitty wooden angels. You guys, aren't these adorable? Okay, also, I figured you could take their wings off and use these as legs too. So, so multi-purpose. And then the reason why I went into Dollar Tree are these guys right here. Um, they're supposed, they're made by stackers. I've been trying them out for the last two weeks or so. And if I take like a half a bottle of one, I'm good for the day, hence all the energy, because I've already had one. And then I picked up nail, uh, nail clippers for Honey on the Road. And then I also last year wasn't able to get my hands on it. So I seen it this year and snatched it on up. I got the beautiful nativity scene. And then I got this guy too, which is a little snowman. And I love the trees. Plus it has Xmas in there. Um, so like Christmas, you know what I mean? So I figured I could use that. I could make it and display it or I can use it on its own. And then they had these adorable bottle brush trees in white with the wood base. And they are two different sizes. Whoops. <laughs> they are two different sizes. So you get a smaller tree. So he's about, I'd say an inch and a half. And this one is about two and a half inches. So you get three of each size in one package. Girl, I am here for it. Thank you, Dollar Tree. Now, let's get into the wowzers, the blows your minds, the whoa, oh my gosh, Dollar Tree, you done did it. But first, I'm gonna show you some new chip clips. They have some more basic colors. Before it's like orange, yellow, red, all these funky colors, which are, it's great because you can find them. But they had um, these guys right here, which was like a teal and a gray, and then a teal and a red. So I figured I'd go ahead and pick those up. And then I couldn't believe this, y'all. They had a pack of three kitchen shears for $1.25. What? Scissors? Okay, three different scissors. So a small, medium, and a large for $1.25. This is by the brand um, Fiber or Farberware or something like that. I don't know. Anyways, who cares? I'm, I'm going to get to the good stuff. Look at this. <gasps> Isn't it gorgeous? Look at that print, y'all. I don't know. I think the camera is like making it look a little funky, but it's beautiful. It's black, um, a black plaid. And I figured it'd be gorgeous with like a, a setup. 
And then you guys, okay, the stuff that just wowed me. Look at this. This is by the brand Simply Essentials. It's three rows of non-skid cabinet organizer, okay? This guy is all plastic. I was so excited about the wired ones and got them home, put all my spices on them and they fall through. Like you have to have them in a certain way or it falls through the little wire. You guys, this is so well made. It has little rubber feet at the bottom of the, um, the tray, but look at it. Isn't it not gorgeous? Look at it. Are you kidding me? I took it up to the register. There was only two of them. I took them up to the register and I said, can you ring this up and make sure it's a dollar 25? I just wanted to make sure someone didn't re you know, put it in the wrong spot. And she goes, yeah, it's a dollar 25. I said, oh my gosh, girl, are you kidding me? You guys, I'm kind of regretting not grow going back and grabbing two more or the rest that they had. Because think of this, this is your spices, your canned goods in your pantry, your craft room, your paints, your glitters, your... Are you kidding me? What a beautiful way to display them. And I checked out the measurements on it and it does fit in the cube organizers. Can you imagine a cube of just like trade? Oh, my heart, I can't, I can't, I can't. You guys, and then look at this. I was blown away. So much so that I picked up all four that they had. It's made by the same brand, Simply Essentials. It is non stick or non or what is it called? Non skid. But y'all, it's a lazy Susan. Are you kidding me? We've been making lazy Susans for like three to four dollars from the Dollar Tree with pizza pans and marbles. But are you kidding me? I was blown away to the point where I bought all that they had. And I think since I'm still in the parking lot, I'm going to go back and get the rest of these trays. I can't believe it. Dollar Tree, that extra dollar is really helping us, or that extra 25 cents. I've been seeing that it has been making a difference. Um, I would say probably we didn't see it right away with the difference of the 25 cents. But if you're going to keep giving me products like that for $1.25, then I'm okay with it. I, right, ladies? We're okay with it. If you keep doing this, though, you know what I'm saying? Yeah. Okay. Anyways, I had to share that with you guys because I was blown away. I think now that I'm doing this video, I am going to run back in there and grab maybe three more. Um, so I got to get back. I got to get dinner going. It's almost four o'clock. I got to get my butt home. Thank you so much for hanging out with me today. Until next time, leave it down in the comments. What do you think of the organizers? I want to know your opinions. And the little wooden angels, aren't they adorable? Okay, got to let you go. I got to go. I'll talk to you guys next time. Bye-bye now. All right, you guys, let's get started. These snowflakes are such a fun size. I really, really like the unfinished wood. They had tons of the bulbs out already, and I know those go quick. And then they had two different shapes of the snowflakes in the MDF, and then they had snowflakes in the natural wood, along with the gingerbread men, and the stars, and an ornament, and here's our laser cut wood pieces. I really enjoy crafting with those. And that little gnomey gnome, if I'm not mistaken, I think is new this year. And then they had the Christmas trees, the snowmen, and the little angels. You guys know I had a stock up on those. They had the gingerbread houses, Santa Claus, all the little kid crafts, but we can turn those into so much more. There's that gnome again. I really think Dollar Tree is maximizing on the gnome being popular. And then I have seen a lot of DIYers turn those into something more for the kid um, kits. And then the trees are so cool because you get a large and a small, three of each in each package. They have the snow fillers, lots of different colored bells, vase fillers, and the itsy bitsy tiny trees. And then here's the ribbons this year. See, there's that gnome again. The red and gray is really pretty together, but I don't think it's really Christmas. That's Ohio State, right? So this is the Dollar Tree Plus section. They had the Nutcrackers for only $5, and I thought they were really well made. And then there's the gnome again. 
Each one of those lanterns lit up for $5. They had a pretty good size Santa. They had some metal reindeer and then a Christmas countdown. Super cute vintage car. The little floor arrangements were only three bucks. And look at this guy. He was $5. He had a light inside and some snow and then floor arrangements. I thought these were new. I thought they were sweet. I thought they were cute. And that's the end of the video. So bye.